Hello everybody, welcome back to another video on my channel. Today's video is going to be a campus food review and I am joined by my friend Yasmin, who's also a student here at Michigan State. Yeah. Um, so <clears throat> we are just gonna go ahead and hop into the video and um, yeah. I'm not like a huge chicken person. Like if I'm eating something and there's like a ton of chicken in it, I just kind of scratch it off to the side. Um, yeah, on the other hand, I love chicken. Chicken everything. Chicken shawarma, gyro, tenders. Your family calls you the chicken bitch. <laughs> As if you follow me on Twitter, you will uh, know what that, you'll get the reference. She knows what she knows. This is good. I'm it's starting to slap on a different level now. Okay, next order of business is dessert. Tea? Um, so we have the Snickerdoodle, an American classic. Oh, this lighting though. You can't see anything. <laughs> <laughs> we love that. Um, Make and... These oh. <gasps> oh. M&M's cookies though. They slap. Alright. Let's cheers. Okay. One, two, tea. That's a good cookie. That's the way it's done. A lot of you bitches. A lot of you bitches don't know. Never had insomnia cookies? Next best thing. So what I said. Alright, now on to the snickerdoodle. It's goddamn good. Mm-hmm. When I eat it, I like it, and I want more. Mm-hmm. Look at this. They even, they didn't even forget about the backside. Inclusiveness. <laughs> I love, um, I don't know what I was going to say. Cookie equality. Cookie equality. <gasps> Wait, what? <laughs> L <laughs> is for the way you look at me. Oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> is something wrong? It's not there's nothing wrong with it. Oh. Honestly. I mean it's cold, but cold pizza is good in its own special way. That's true. Hmm. I don't like when it does that. Like when I bite into it, I want the cheese and everything else to be severed off with my teeth. I don't like when stragglers try to come in here. <laughs> yeah, they're trying to get a free ride. Out of my. Not on my watch. Not on my watch. This is something like kind of hard for um, me to talk about, but it is now time to try Holden Dining Hall's Pasta Alfredo. The original uh, <clears throat> Sir Alfredo who created Alfredo sauce. I'm so sorry, sweetie. I don't know how what you made got from that point to now whatever this is. I don't know where the evolution went wrong. Okay, I need to do this. It's like a band-aid. You know, it hurts and then it feels better after it's done. To it, it gets worse over time. Food should do the opposite of that. Hmm. 
it has like a like a mushy non-smooth texture to it like it's lumpy uh, yeah mm -hmm. but not in like in an authentic way more in the way of like there's chunks of powder or flour that were not properly smoothed out I the reason I keep eating is because I'm trying to find a redeeming word of advice avoid holding at all costs um that that's that if anybody from Holden Hall culinary services is watching this it's it's nothing personal. No, not at all. We appreciate what you're doing for us and we're thankful for it. It's just, it's not slapping to the. In the world's, in the word, in the words of Coldplay, when you try your best but you don't succeed. Did Henry Ford succeed the first time he built the Model T? Fair point. No. Did Bill Gates succeed the first time he built Microsoft? No. I actually don't know either of those for a fact, but I'm assuming. You have to seek failure before you can succeed. Yes. Succeed. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, that's all for now, folks. If you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Thank you so much. Have a great week.